It was June 26, 2003. 26-year-old Patricia Hughes was watching her two-year-old daughter and an 11-year-old in the 9500 block of North Oliver. The two-year-old fell in the pool. Hughes jumped in to save her and hit her head, drowning. She ran to the neighbor's house, got the, uh, the telephone, uh, and called 911, and then ran back to the pool to check on the condition of the, uh, of the 24-year-old babysitter. The 11-year-old pulled the child to safety. Now, eight years later, Hughes' death is being ruled murder in the first degree. Cedric County Sheriff's investigators won't say much about the case, except to say they issued a warrant for the arrest of Hughes' neighbor, Daniel Perez. Searching through old court documents, we learn Daniel Perez used the alias of Lou Castro while living in Valley Center, a man who had spent time in the Texas prison system for indecent liberties with a child. Hughes died in 2003. Just three years later, her husband Bryant died in what was ruled an accident in South Dakota. Guardianship of the Hughes daughter, who was then five, was granted to another neighbor named Jennifer Hudson. But in another strange twist, Hudson was killed in 2008 when a gravel truck struck her car head on. The Hughes daughter had now lost her parents and her guardian. During court hearings on the matter, attorneys representing the child told the judge, quote, there have been multiple other deaths. Ten have been identified associated with a person who identifies himself as Lou Castro, a.k.a. Daniel Perez, his wife, Kara Lemer, and Hudson's husband, all the while obtaining life insurance proceeds associated with the people who died.